Dave, tell us about how Garden Song came into being. Well, actually, I think this starts at a very interesting time in the pandemic where all four of us were doing an hour's live stream a week. Do you remember that? Mm -hmm. Joyous time. Um, And (laughs) we kind of got to a stage where we had ran out of things to do. So I kind of said what the thing I would do is, is I would write a song on a live stream, which is an off idea because writing a song is hard enough and then doing it on a live stream is sort of torturing yourself but it was amazing because I think a lot of people in that time were the the garden and the outdoors was kind of their sanctuary and and giving them a lot of a, a good place to be and then we were in studio we were recording the song and I think I can't remember, was one of you fellas that was like it would be really cool to have a female voice on it and I feel like it was at the same moment, we all said the same name, Abigail Washburn. You got on to Abigail to be on the track and mm. Claw Hammer. And She's yeah. awesome. And I mean, you've done a great job playing Claw Hammer on it. And then we said, Abigail is a master on Claw Hammer. <laughs> and she has a, a brilliant voice, which, because of that old timey feel that the song has, I mean, that's completely her wheelhouse. And she made a fantastic job. Like, her, her vocal on the song is incredible. And a dream come true too like mm. to be able to play on a, tr- on a track with Abigail Washburn it's like great you can all retire now happy 